Howdy howdy, this is Crafty Grinding back again with an arena cutoff video for Marvel Contest of Champions. Today I'm going to cover round one results for the Blade and Rocket Raccoon arenas, then do a little past arena trend analysis to come up with round two predictions for these same arenas. So let's go ahead and jump into round one results, kind of as expected with a little lower cutoffs um, for Rocket and Blade in the three-star feature. But as expected for the four-star feature, as you can see here on the left, Blade came in with a 19.3 million cutoff. That's a new all-time high. Fortunately, we haven't got to 20 million yet, so celebrate while you can, though, because with the Valor uh, currency coming into the game with the Thor Ragnarok events um, in November, you can expect these numbers will probably go over 20 million because that four star feature will give additional valor. But we'll talk about that at a later date. Back in for these round one results, as you can see here, the top 10% came in at 4.6 million. And what you can't see though, but for those shard hunters out there, that 11% came in right above 2 million. Then we jump over to the four star basic rocket raccoon arena and uh, performed a little lower. The cutoff was a little lower um, for a low interest i mean that's still kind of the bottom um the, the, this 1.9 million has been um shown up before but it's not like the 2.3 2.2 which is the higher end of the low interest here for four star basic which some of the community thought because he since he hits pretty hard has a little utility in the game that he might get up closer to that but no it looks like either people were focused uh, on the blade arenas or just really didn't have interest in him so he came to that 1.9 million with 11 to 25 percent tier coming at 1.54 million then lastly, we jump over here to the right to the uh, three-star feature. Blade did not get a all-time high cutoff for that. That still belongs to Mephisto, but he did get over 1.5 million. As you can see here, got to right under, but rounding up to 1.52 million with 11 to 25 percent coming in at 646,000. How do these actual results compare to the uh, trend analysis that came that went into the predictions for round one? So as we can see here, the four star feature almost hit directly on it. <laughs> I mean, it was just a little off. So that definitely was a good prediction. The trends held tight on that one for sure. Um, when we looked at the uh, Rocket Raccoon, though, this was while well, again, this because of the interest and the community feeling this might be a little higher of the low interest just because of he still has some utility hits pretty hard in the game um, that's what those predictions were based off of and those were missed the good news is if you played to those predictions you got rocket you just had to put a little extra grind time in and lastly jumping over to the three star feature here this was a little bit higher that 1.7 million and that 670,000 was a little higher than the cutoff but it's still within that 10% range so you did have to put a little extra grind time in but still within that 10% range of error so a decent um um, decent um, uh, prediction all the same so good to see that the trends are holding a bit a bit here unfortunately though the trends of going higher and higher with that four star feature just continue to come to life unfortunately so what does this mean for round two so when we take let's start with the four star feature on the left here you can see with the medusa mephisto and morning star for the most part the first round and second round cutoffs were pretty close with the second round cutoffs being a couple hundred thousand higher except in the case of morning star with morning star it just pummeled or plummeted i should say plummeted all the way to, uh, almost six million to 11 million i think um that's not going to be that's not representative of what we're seeing here oh, while morning stars are great champ and all there's just not the interest that um that you know folks have in the community for for her compared to blade i think mephisto and medusa are, are better reflected specifically the Medu uh, mephisto even at 18.5 he went to 18.83 in the second round i think with blade you're going to see something similar to that right around that same cutoff we saw in the first round when it comes to the top 10 percent and 11 percent tier levels you can see those are pretty similar between round one and round two so we can expect and, and a pretty i mean it's flat line you can see that that's a pretty stable trend um arena over arena then we jump over to the middle to the four star basic um, when we look at some of the past um low interest champs that do have some utility uh, value still in the game like black panther old man logan iron fist again these aren't super champs but they still have some value still are useful to have in the game you can see the second round was a little bit higher than the first round except in the case of iron fist it still was higher but just not as much you're almost an, uh, an extra hundred thousand in the case of black panther and old, Mo old man logan where you're only like 10 20 000 higher for iron fist and then when you look at that 11 to 25 percent tier it kind of ebb and flows peaks and valleys 
the same way with, but a little flatter, not to the same degree, uh, not with that same slope as the um, the, the champion, that 10% tier, but um, there is a little, that, that second round cutoff is a little bit higher for that 11 to 25% tier. And lastly, to the right, when you look at the three star feature arenas, um, Two out of the last three, when you look at Medusa and Morningstar, they all had a pretty significant drop between round one caught off and round, round, round two when you go down almost like 300 400 thousand but in the case of uh, mephisto a champ that most folks had a lot of interest in and still wanted he only dropped a hundred thousand in round two and i think that's something you're going to see here um in round two with blade given all the interest in the community for him even after everybody got their hands on him or i should say more folks got his hands on him more folk after that it didn't like sometimes when that happens you know the community finds out he's not, a champ's not as good as people were talking about but in the case of blade i don't think that's the case i think the hype is still there so i think we're going to see something similar to mephisto which is important um, not only for the drop for the uh, the the 10 percent tier but even if you look at the 11 to 25 percent tier for those tier hunter those um, shard hunters out there the second round for mephisto's arena didn't drop and actually went up a little bit compared to the first round cutoff whereas for medusa and morningstar um, where the interest just wasn't there as much it did actually drop in the limited percent here so i think we're going to see something very similar for blade um, as, as the mephisto arenas so with all of that in mind um, I, like I was saying for the four star feature prediction and again folks this is for the veterans bracket so this is veteran bracket predictions I think you're going to see the, uh, the the four star feature come in right around the 19.6 number which is a couple hundred thousand than we saw for the four, for the first round cutoff this again is very similar to what we saw for the Medusa and Mephisto arenas with the top 10% coming in at 4.8 million and the 11% um, prediction coming in at 2.1 million we jump over to the four star basic for rocket you can see a couple hundred that not even a couple hundred that hundred thousand left hundred you know hundred fifty thousand left you're coming right around 2.2 million when you round up and 11 to 25 percent coming in at 1.65 million and lastly for the three star feature i think again here we're not going to see the same drop that we saw for medusa and morningstar instead we're going to see a drop similar for mephisto which is about a hundred thousand so i think that cutoff is going to be around 1.43 million and in the case of the 11 to 25 percent again i think it's going to go up a little bit compared to the first round similar again to the mephisto arena and so i think that comes in right around 680,000. so these based off of the trends based off of you know what we've seen all those past arenas this is where i think the cutoffs will be so you never want to just play to that number because you know the exceptions can occur so if you really want to the champ and you might have to go over a little bit more than where the cutoff goes here are the grind targets to go to that 20 million you want to make sure you get blade go to 20 million guess what you're going to get blade if you go to 20 million for the top 10 percent 5 million um, for the 11 to 12 uh, for the 11 percent um, shard hunters out there go to 2.3 million now if you want to make sure you get rocket for the four star basic go to 2.4 million you get to 2.4 million you're going to get rocket and for the 11 to 25 percent go to 1.8 million and lastly for the three star feature i think 1.45 million this is not a significant difference for the prediction just in case there is that uh, drop closer to medusa and morningstar than just for mephisto i think 1.45 million should get you blade now again this is my my grind target if you really really want them and you know think you want to go a little bit higher than that by all means go as high as you want <laughs> but i think even with 4.1.45 you should be pretty safe in getting blade with 11 to 25 percent coming in at 700 and thousand and again this, these grind targets as well as these predictions are for the veterans bracket um for the beginners and intermediate bracket there's just not a lot of history out there but i did want to provide some ranges based off of the input that i have received from the community as well as my own personal experience here over the last couple months um, three star feature you can grab them for around 245,000 even for new champs like blade or four star basic 750,000 for a champ like Ro a rocket raccoon usually worked and the four star feature you need to go over 1 million now when you jump into the intermediate bracket and this is for accounts that have been open 31 to 60 days not played but actually opened um, you can get the uh, three star features run around 650,000 uh, the four star basic around 1 million for, for a champ like rocket and then for a new champ like blade the four star feature you're going to need to go around to 1.6 1.7 million and again these are very rough estimates just because there's just not a lot of historical data out there to base trends against so take these with a grain of salt push past these numbers if you really want these champs and you should be fine but anyway these are my thoughts on the um 
round one results as, as well as the round two predictions. We'd love to hear yours. If you have any questions, throw it down in the comments. If you have any additional builds or uh, disagreements or different thoughts on uh, how round two will play out, we'd love to hear about it in the comment section. We can talk about it there for sure. Um, if you like this video, I really appreciate you hitting that thumbs up button. And if you like this video and others that I have in the arena, arena <laughs> in my channel, would really appreciate uh, a subscribe. Other than that, thanks a lot for stopping by and have a great day.